In the unforgiving world of geopolitics, sometimes you need a tool that can go where no one else dares. On June 21, 2025, that tool was the B-2 Spirit. As the world slept, these machines launched from Whiteman Air Force Base, Missouri on a mission deep into Iran. Their targets, Iran's most fortified nuclear facilities, Fordow, Natanz and Isfahan, buried and shielded by advanced air defenses. For any conventional aircraft, this would be a suicide run, but the B-2 is no ordinary bomber. It's a ghost, built to slip past enemy eyes and deliver a precise, devastating blow. The decision to send in the B-2S marked a major escalation, a high-stakes gamble on the world stage. Pilots flew thousands of miles, refueling in mid-air, pushing both man and machine to the limit. President Trump called the strikes a spectacular success, and for once, the rhetoric matched reality. The B-2's ability to penetrate the world's toughest air defenses is its core survival skill, striking without warning, leaving adversaries stunned. For Iran, it was as if the bombs materialized from thin air, a psychological shock as much as a physical one. The world held its breath, but the message was clear. No target is truly safe from American air power. The B-2 spirit remains the apex predator of the skies, the ultimate survival tool in the deadliest game of all. Subscribe, like, and share Cosmo Academia. Subscribe, like, and share Cosmo Academia. Every survivor has an origin story. The B-2s began in the shadows of the Cold War, the U.S. needed a bomber that could survive the most dangerous environment imaginable, Soviet airspace, bristling with radar and missiles. Northrop Grumman took on the challenge, shrouded in secrecy, to create something invisible to its enemies. The answer? The flying wing, a radical design with no tail or fuselage, inherently stealthy. The B-2's first flight in 1989 stunned the world. By 1993, it was ready for action. Billions were spent on new materials, computer systems, and manufacturing techniques to make a bomber that could disappear from radar. Only 21 were built, now 19 in service, all based at Whiteman Air Force Base. Each B-2 is a marvel of engineering, designed for the most critical missions on the planet. Conceived in a world of superpower confrontation, the B-2 has proven its worth in unpredictable conflicts ever since. It's not just a machine, it's the embodiment of a survival mindset, engineered to conquer the most hostile environments. The B-2 is a true survivor, born from the shadows and built to rule the sky. Its legacy is one of human ingenuity pushed to the limit. To survive, you must master camouflage. The B-2 spirit does this in the world of electronic warfare. Its flying wing design deflects radar waves, while its skin is coated in top-secret radar-absorbent material, RAM. This coating absorbs radar energy, turning it into heat and preventing detection. Every seam and panel is meticulously sealed to maintain its stealth shield. The result? A radar cross-section the size of a bird, virtually invisible to enemy radar. Enemy operators might see a blip, dismissing it as a glitch or a flock of birds. The B-2's engines are buried within the wings, shielding their heat from infrared sensors. Exhaust gases are cooled and vented above the aircraft, masking its thermal signature. It's also incredibly quiet, muffling engine noise within its airframe. The B-2 doesn't just hide from radar, it minimizes its presence across radar, heat and sound. This holistic stealth approach lets it hunt without being hunted. The B-2 is the ultimate predator, using every trick to remain unseen. Invisibility is its greatest survival skill. Inside the B-2 lies a blend of power, technology and human endurance. Four non-afterburning engines are buried in the wing, reducing heat and noise for stealth. The cockpit is compact, designed for a two-person crew, pilot and mission commander among the Air Force's elite. Missions can last over 40 hours, so the cockpit includes a cot, toilet and meal station. The crew's focus digital displays controlling navigation, weapons and defense systems. The B-2's range is global, over 6,000 nautical miles on internal fuel, unlimited with mid-air refueling. It can strike any target on the planet and return home without landing abroad. Its survival depends on stealth, not speed, operating from low altitude to over 50,000 feet. This flexibility lets it exploit gaps in enemy radar and terrain. The B-2's adaptability makes it a survivor, ready for any mission, anywhere, anytime. Subscribe, like, and share Cosmo Academia. Stealth is useless without a lethal bite, and the B-2 delivers. Its two internal weapons bays carry up to 40,000 pounds of ordnance, everything from smart bombs to nuclear weapons. By keeping weapons inside, the B-2 preserves its stealth until the moment of attack. It can drop up to 80 precision-guided JDAMs in a single pass, devastating multiple targets with pinpoint accuracy. For hardened targets, 
It carries the GBU-57A-B Massive Ordnance Penetrator, a 30-000-pound bunker buster. The B-2 is the only aircraft capable of delivering this weapon, smashing through reinforced concrete to destroy underground facilities. In the Iran strikes, the MOP proved its worth. No other plane could have done the job. The bomb bay doors open for seconds, then close, restoring stealth as the B-2 turns for home. The enemy may not realize they're under attack until it's too late. The B-2 is a flying sledgehammer, striking with devastating force from the shadows. The B-2's legacy is forged in combat. In Kosovo, 1999, B-2S flew non-stop from Missouri, destroying a third of Serbian targets in eight weeks. After 9-11s, B-2S struck Taliban and Al-Qaeda targets in Afghanistan, flying some of the longest missions in history. In Iraq, they dropped over 1.5 million pounds of munitions, crippling Saddam's regime. The B-2 has also struck ISIS in Libya and Houthi targets in Yemen, proving its reach against both states and non-state actors. Its ability to operate globally undetected has made it the Air Force's silver bullet. From state armies to terrorist camps to nuclear bunkers, the B-2 dominates any environment. Its combat record is unmatched, surviving and thriving where others would fail. The B-2 is a global hunter, striking America's enemies wherever they hide. Its reputation is built on results. Survival at the highest level comes at a price. The B-2 is the world's most expensive aircraft, at $2.1 billion each. That cost reflects revolutionary technology, composite structures, classified radar absorbent materials, and precision engineering. The B-2's skin is fragile, requiring climate-controlled hangars and constant costly maintenance. Manufacturing demanded new techniques and unprecedented quality control. Every seam had to be perfect. Originally 132 were planned, but only 21 were built, driving up the per-plane cost. For the Air Force, the price is worth it. The B-2 can hold any target on Earth at risk, no matter the defenses. It's a weapon of strategic deterrence, shaping adversaries' decisions before conflict begins. The high price isn't just for an aircraft, it's for dominance and a unique strategic edge. In global security, the ability to survive and strike anywhere is, in truth, priceless. The B-2's cost is the price of unmatched power. Subscribe, like, and share Cosmo Academia. Like an apex predator, the B-2 changes the behavior of every rival on the world stage. Its main mission isn't just to fight wars, but to prevent them. Deterrence through undeniable power. The B-2's existence forces adversaries to think twice before acting, knowing no target is beyond reach. Its dual capability, conventional and nuclear, makes it a cornerstone of the U.S. nuclear triad. Unlike missiles, the B-2 is recallable, giving the president flexible options in a crisis. Its survivability ensures America's deterrent remains credible. The Iran strikes were more than destruction. They were a demonstration of power, a warning to any nation. There is no sanctuary. Deployments to Europe or the Pacific make headlines, reassuring allies and warning rivals. Even when not in combat, the B-2 is a symbol of American resolve and technological leadership. Its presence alone shapes global security calculations. In an unstable world, the B-2 is more than a bomber, it's a guardian. Its shadow helps keep the peace through strength. The B-2's deterrent power is as vital as its bombs. Even the greatest survivor must adapt. The B-2's successor, the B-21 Raider, is already on the horizon. The B-21 will build on the B-2's lessons, with next-gen stealth, advanced networking, and more affordable maintenance. But the B-2's story isn't over. Upgrades keep it at the cutting edge, and its unique ability to carry the mop ensures a vital role for years. The B-2 revolutionized air warfare, proving stealth could render traditional air defenses obsolete. Its design principles now shape every modern combat aircraft. The B-2 changed the shape of air power, forcing nations to rethink defense and offense. It stands as the pinnacle of human innovation in the quest for survival in modern warfare. Its spirit lies in the strategic advantage it provides, not just its airframe. As long as threats hide behind defenses, there will be a need for a tool that operates in the shadows. The B-2's legacy will shape the future, reminding the world that in the sky, the ultimate survivor is the one never seen. Subscribe, like, and share Cosmo Academia.